सो हेलो ऑल आई वेलकम यू ऑल टू वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट सेशन ऑफ एन आई सी और नाइलेट टू थाउजेंड ट्वेंटी एग्जाम प्रिपेरेशन ओके सो इन दिस सेशन वी विल डिस्कस सम इम्पोर्टेंट पॉइंट ओके रिलेटेड टू योर सिलेबस एंड ऑल्सो आई विल टेल यू एक्सपेक्टेड एग्जाम डेट सो यू कैन प्लान योर स्केड्यूल अकॉर्डिंगली ओके सो फर्स्ट लेट मी टेल यू दैट द फॉर्म डेट इज एक्सटेंडेड एज यू नो एंड लास्ट डेट इज नाउ थर्टी अप्रिल सो दो डिडेंट अप्लाई टिल नाउ यू कैन अप्लाई नाउ ओके ऑल द रिक्रूटमेंटेड इन्फॉर्मेशन आई ऑलरेडी शेयर ऑन माई चैनल सो यू कैन वॉच दैट वीडियो ओके ऑल दीडियो गाइडेंस वीडियो रिगार्डिंग डिलेट यू विल गेट ऑन दिस प्लेटफॉर्म ओनली ओके सो वॉच ऑल द वीडियो रिगार्डिंग दिस एंड यू विल गेट अ लॉट्स ऑफ हेल्प ओके so let me tell you the expected exam date first okay then we will do do our discussion so you can expect the exam in june last week okay or you can expect in june july first week okay so this exam date i consider according to the situation of the lockdown that is uh, on 3rd may okay it will be end so if on 3rd may lockdown gets closed okay or it will be end then obviously july last week or in july first week you can expect the exam okay so let me tell you some important point related to it okay while analyzing the syllabus for mentorship program i okay i analyze this points which is very important for you so that's why i thought to share with you guys also because 99% students obviously didn't have idea about it okay so i am giving you little brief Uh, about this uh, syllabus that is this is your for scientist b and this is your for technical assistant a okay so this is very important you have to remember on this your for scientist b so see now to cover this exam uh, this a uh, very important syllabus you need first basics and understanding of probability theory okay this is very important to understand the probability theory first then you can uh, shift to obviously in probability theory you will get conditional probability also okay this mean median mode standard deviation is easy and it's a uh, no issue but you have to do uh, probability theory obviously because that probability theory you will apply in random variables so this is very important to understand and obviously many people uh, don't uh, means okay so just understand the probability theory is very important for random variables and after distributions okay uniform normal exponential poisson binomial so till then till this uh, this is very important that point of random variables and processes okay then after that you have permutations and combinations okay you, you know this points which is very which is you can also you have you know your aptitude part okay and this part that is a uh, count from counting to asymptotic this part is of discrete mathematics so this is very important to understand so the com this pro first part of your syllabus that is probability statistics and combinatorics is composed of probability theory random variables distributions okay permutation combinations and this that is discrete mathematics so this is the composition composition of all and as i told you earlier also you can expect 30 marks for electronic portion so obviously in that 30 marks this will play your important role that is up to 3 to 4 marks question out of this 30 you can expect from this topic which is very important for you okay so you have to do this topic no option there okay because you know the competition is very high and obviously syllabus is very vast but and obviously this is important topic for your syllabus okay now see for technical assistant i will tell you you have to do also same like you have to do probability theory okay in that you have to do probability sampling theorems all the sampling theorem you should know okay then obviously in probability theory you will uh, you will get to study this conditional probability okay after that you also have mean median mode and standard deviations and now here see random variables discrete and continuous distribution distributions okay so now this is very important to understand so for technical assistant you need detailed signals and system knowledge for to understand this that is discrete random variables and continuous random variables without signal and system knowledge okay you can't understand this so for which is very important point okay no one will tell you this so just remember for technical assistant if you fill this form then you should have signals and system okay basic knowledge and this signal system is included in this scientist b syllabus so 
for you guys very important to understand this then only you can understand random variable discrete and continuous distributions okay rest of all the same that is poisson normal and binomial distribution and you have here correlation and regression analysis okay so this correlation and autocorrelation part also you have in signal system also okay so they set your frame your syllabus very smartly here so obviously you should understand the syllabus very deeply okay this is very important for any competitive exam that you should understand the syllabus you should understand the requirements of what they want from you okay so you can also expect 4 to 5 marks from this that is 4 to 5 marks you can expect okay which is very important so you can't skip this chapter and if you skip this then you will obviously lose a big opportunity okay so you have to do this compulsory so let me give you some brief about what is this uh, random variables and all this okay just a little idea to help you to understand it okay obviously in mentorship program we will cover all these things in very much detail because you need this okay so we will cover it now see for now just i am taking one example that is i am tossing a coin twice okay twice i am tossing a coin so so my sample space is like this okay these are my events this call events okay just understood so first time while tossing i got head okay second time i got head so this is first event second uh, second event is like this first time i got head and second time i got tail third event is this that is first time i got tail okay second time i got head and the fourth time is this that is i got both time that is tail so these are your events okay and for each event let's i am supposing i am supposed i am taking i am getting head okay this is my event so this event have now see when i toss a coin okay i will either get never get head okay for the first time so this is zero okay i may get head in first throw or first toss in or in second toss okay so one time i will get head okay just observe the carefully one time i will get head okay and it may be also possible that both the times i will got i will get head so this is the event of getting head okay and for this you have this set of values 0 1 2 and this set of values have we assign a random variable to analyze it okay for this set of value we assign a random variable to analyze it so this is the application of random variable that's why we use it okay to understand the event possibilities okay possibility of events this is very important and what is random process random process you can observe if you are observing this event at some particular time suppose a 41 time so this is your random process then so obviously this knowledge you should have okay you should understand these things and which is very important for you and always it keeps you ahead of competition this thing okay because all the easy things already all people do easy things that is no big deal but if you understand conceptually and please i am again telling you okay study conceptually don't distract from your path which is very important okay let me give you some quick update regarding mentorship program for nic 2020 okay we we have now full syllabus that is the csit syllabus also have we have okay so those who are interested and those who want to know about more information okay regarding this program you can just check description in that i gave all the information and you obviously join our whatsapp group there are total seven groups now okay seven is currently running so join you can join it and you can contact me through it okay so i will strictly tell you if you are focused for nic okay and you are only given NIC 220 exam then you should join this program guys which is very important for you okay obviously fees are very less you can compare with uh, anything okay and this is not like a paid course so this is your mentorship program you will get to know what is this okay so you can uh, get your information while by, by contacting me okay so this is very important and with this prepare smartly and just stay focused okay all the best